Hi, I thought we might just chat for a few minutes while we're waiting on my stuff over there to get to simmering about this meal. They have wood cuttings every year here, every winter. All the communities get together and they cut the wood. There's been a lot of tornado, tornado damage here in this area. And so that way they get together and there's usually a lot of older people that own lots of land. And so they'll let them come and they'll cut wood on there to help them clean it up and supply them with the wood and give them all of the wood that they need. Because there's a lot of paper company in this area. And they come with their cross cut saws and they bust it and they work hard and the young ladies get out with them and they, they stack and they carry every bit of that wood and work just as hard as the men. And then the mothers and the little ones, they will get all the food together and they will have a good meal for them at lunch. They feed them snacks, one before, one after. And, um, and it's just really a large thing. And about three years ago, they did this for us over when we lived on Russell Creek. And um, they cut us enough firewood that lasted us that we just finished it up this year. That was how much wood they cut at a time when they cut it. And this year we've had a little bit extra brought in just to kind of top us off. But um, I took this casserole down there and they just gobbled it up because by the time me and the kids got there to get some, it was gone. There was more food there, plenty of more food. But for some reason, this certain dish was gone first. I guess they never tried it before and they kind of liked it. So I think that I might try this one more often. Now we'll go over here and check our food here in just a few minutes. Just thought I'd give you that little bit of tidbits. And just one more thing I want to let you know. I have my own web website up that I will be selling some of my products on. My seasonings that I use, my cookbooks that I have ordered. I will be writing my own cookbook in the future also to put on it. And my daughter has a, po a poetry book she's going to be publishing. And we'll be putting that on there in the long run. And I've got some herbs and sauces put up there that I'm fixing to get ready and mark them. But I do have the CDs and I do have a, a cookbook, Concrete Cookery on there, ready for sale. So she, you should check it out. But you need to check out my blog part, folk. My blog post first. Sorry, y'all. My blog post first because it seems to be easier to get to my website, which is my Wix website. And this this is my site. It's um, Misty's dash Misty's Kitchen blogpost.com. And I I have to type it in as http dot dot slash slash Misty's dash kitchen dot blog spot dot com dash two o eleven dash o one slash Misty's dash kitchen html and when I go there it also brings up my website which is www.wix.com slash Misty six slash Misty's dash kitchen kind of long kind of confusing but until I get everything set up a little better, this is what I've got.